Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be like a real mix of things that have been going on in my life recently. There's been a lot going on. I've kind of got little clips from here and there, so I'm hoping to put it all together into a really nice video. So I really hope you enjoy seeing what's been going on lately. Before I jump into the vlog though, I just wanted to talk to you guys first of all about a brand that I have spoken about before and they are called Good Pick and they make, if you couldn't tell already, they make incredible baskets that are woven and made from recycled and eco-friendly materials. Um, so I was sent one of their baskets previously and I use it in my room. It's kind of like back here for like blankets and pillows. Good Pick were super kind and they sent me another basket which is this one here um, which is one of their laundry baskets this is the large camel laundry basket um, I picked it just because I love the colors the kind of cream and the brown really ties into my room I feel like with the natural wood that I have going on um, and the kind of pale walls so I really love it as you can see I've already filmed it with my laundry um, and it is a huge basket I feel like you would never feel the pressure to, to do laundry with this basket because it is so big. Just for like reference, this laundry basket is so big, you would be able to fit so much laundry in here. It would be perfect if you have, I don't know, even lots, lots of clothes or a big family. Like there is so much space in this basket. It's brilliant. Um, but yeah, Good Pick make amazing different baskets for all different rooms, all different storage ideas. So pillows, blankets, laundry, toys if you have kids i feel like they'd be great to put in a corner of a room and just chuck all your kids toys in and it would be like a really elegant way of keeping your room looking nice while having kids toys in, in the room i just think they are really beautiful pieces of furniture that kind of really bring an element of like the natural outdoors inside and they're just really nice ways to like store and display your things um they do like really tiny little baskets as well which would be fabulous in like a bathroom or in your hallway to put like keys in so yeah thank you so much good pick for sending me another one of your baskets i absolutely love it so all the links guys are going to be down in the description box for you so please don't hesitate to check them out so yeah that's all i have to say right now i hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video which like i said is a real mix of lots of different things but it's a fun one so enjoy So I started my week with my office days and after my office day I travelled across London to go and get my laser hair removal done which I've been having for the past sort of a year or so now I'd say, um, every few weeks and it's been incredible. Um, so here's me travelling on the tube and arriving at Pulse Light Clinic which is where I go and get my laser, they are amazing. And if you guys want me to make an entire video on my laser hair removal journey, please let me know in the comments because I know it's something that can spark a lot of questions and it's good to get info from people that have had it done firsthand. Uh, and then this little clip is just Oxford Street that evening, which was looking really pretty um, with the clouds <laughs> and all the people and the busyness. So as some of you may know, Holly, who is my sister, and myself, we set up a brand called Nana a few years ago, which had to kind of come to a bit of a halt. Uh, the pandemic and just our crazy lives kind of took over, but we are very excited to be hopefully relaunching the brand very, very soon. So all of you guys, I hope you're, you get excited and yeah, look out for things to come. Um, this evening, um, we basically did a sit down and had a meeting and site planning um, for the upcoming relaunch. Um, I'm really excited and yeah, I hope you guys are too. There's a little bit more later on in this video. So don't forget if you're not already, go and give Nana Store a follow on Instagram uh, just to, to make sure you know all the key dates. Okay, so this is probably one of my favourite days of the year so far. This was the London Marathon and Holly was running in it again. So of course, the whole family and friends came and watched her and we had an incredible day. So I'm going to stop talking and just let you enjoy this footage because it's such a good day. Yeah. 
So this is what we found Holly sat next to a tree after her race and she did it in an incredible time of under three hours and 30 minutes. So you absolutely smashed it, dude. I was so proud. And yeah, it was just a great, great day. <laughs> So once Holly had recovered, we all decided to go climbing and as you guys may know, bouldering is a new hobby of mine and I would definitely recommend giving it a go. Okay, so if you want to see the inside of an embroidery factory, you have come to the right video. Here is Holly and I going to our meeting um, at our embroiderers, and this is what it looks like inside. All of our embroidery for Nana will happen and be conducted in the UK. We want everything to be done locally and sustainably, and this works the best for us. It means we have the best control and we can see exactly what goes into each of the products. So yeah, this is just a little insight and hopefully gets you even more excited for the relaunch. So that's it for this video guys thank you so much for sticking around to the end if you're still here don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you all very soon in my next video bye for now